when light goes from one medium to another, as happens here when this laser beam goes into this acrylic and then has a chance to go into air, it can either reflect or it can refract. Right now we're seeing both these phenomena, but it's possible to set things up in such a way that we only get reflection. As I make the incident angle less steep, whoops, wrong way, as I make this angle more steep, I see that the refracted beam disappears. And so now what I have is total internal reflection with no refracted beam on the left. What's interesting about this is I can actually frustrate this total internal reflection and produce a refracted beam by pressing a lens to the spot where the beam reflects. What I'm doing is I'm reducing the airspace between these two surfaces, the acrylic prism and the lens. When I do that, you see that a red dot appears next to the shadow of my thumb on the left-hand side. This is known as frustrated total internal reflection.